Even if I end up losing weight this week, this week cannot be considered progress. Hi guys, Dad Bod to Bad Dad here, back with another video. This is my weekly weigh-in, and I am not happy about it. No matter if I have a loss or if I gain, this is definitely not a week of progress for me. I did not get back in the gym as promised. I don't know why. I was super excited once I rolled back into town. I wanted to go so bad. I can't say my diet was completely off the rails, but towards the end of the week, like, you know, when I had to go away, that's when I just completely lost it. I don't even know what happened. If you already know me, I don't like to waste any time. Let's get over to that scale footage. Okay guys, so it was 317.1 the last week. Let's see what my weigh-in says this week. Three fifteen point eight. So over a pound lost. I'll take it. Wasn't my greatest week ever. I've got to get back to the gym and back on this diet. Let's get a subscribe and a notification bell for that 1.3 weight loss this week. I hate to say that I'm not happy with the weight loss, but if you saw what I did to myself this week and my mentality, you would completely understand why. And if you've ever had this feeling after a weight loss, please leave me a comment in the comment section because I'd like to know, like, am I being ridiculous by feeling this way? 1.3 pounds is normally like a good average weight loss. Like if I did that every single week, I'd be, I'd, I'd lose more than my goal within a year. I'm not gonna make a long video about this. I'll come back in the middle of the week and tell you how I'm doing. I'm gonna keep rolling. I'm gonna keep going. There's no time to quit. I'm still way ahead of where I was a month ago. So I gotta be happy about that. I'm gonna get back to doing my smoothies. I'm gonna get back to doing healthier meals uh, in the past few weeks I don't know if I've talked about it much but I went to more of an OMAD one meal a day format which I had pretty much whatever I wanted for that one meal and then I would have like coffee or some sort of caffeine to keep me going later on in the evening hours which did help with my weight loss but it didn't set me up necessarily for the healthiest mindset so I might implement OMAD if I have a mess up meal and I'm not trying to leave room for a mess up meal. It's just, I have to keep my calories restricted. So that's gonna be the way that I'm gonna go about it. And that's what we're gonna go with this week. We're gonna try to do smaller, healthier, whole food meals like salads, chicken, potatoes, broccoli, you know, you know the stick. You guys have been doing weight loss journeys for a while now too, most of you. So we're gonna get back to doing all of that we are gonna get back to doing at least four times in the gym, hopefully five. And there is one other thing that I have been neglecting, which is my walks. It has been getting a little hotter out in Las Vegas, so daytime walks haven't been as advantageous with the toddler. She really overheats quick. So we're gonna to have to make use of evening walks. I'm not a super great morning person to get up and do that, but I would love to start getting up in the morning and doing walks. So I won't go on and ramble too much, not too much new going on, but please like, give me that comment I asked for before, and hit the subscribe button and ring that notification bell so you never miss a video. It's Dad Bod to Bad Dad, and I appreciate and love you all.